PSG president Nasser al khalifi has expressed the club's desire to part ways with Parc des Princes, stating, it's over now. Hello everyone, and welcome to Ballers. al khalifi lamented the years PSG spent attempting to purchase the stadium, suggesting that it was a wasted effort. PSG President Nasser al khalifi has confirmed that Paris Saint-Germain will be departing the Parc des Princes after their unsuccessful attempts to purchase the stadium from the city. Paris Saint-Germain, the French champions, have been striving to acquire ownership of the Parc des Princes from the city of Paris. However, negotiations for the sale have not materialized, with PSG President Nasser al khalifi alleging discrimination by the council due to the club's Qatari ownership. Consequently, PSG has decided to embark on the quest for a new stadium. We know what we want, we wasted years trying to buy the park, PSG President Nasser al khalifi stated in an interview with French media on Thursday. It's over now, we want to move on from the park. PSG have been based at the Parc des Princes since 1974, but their attempts to purchase the stadium have hit a roadblock, with the Parisian Council citing its status as part of the city's heritage. This impasse has led PSG to consider building their own stadium, as they have ruled out relocating to the Stade de France, the national stadium. From the start, we have wanted PSG to remain at the Parc des Princes, stated Pierre Rabadon, the deputy for sport. However, we are unwilling to compromise on Parisian heritage. With their ambitions to expand the stadium's capacity stalled, PSG will now explore alternative options for a new home. Despite having a contractual agreement to remain at the Parc des Princes until 2043, the club is determined to pursue avenues that will accommodate their vision for a larger venue, aiming for a capacity of around 60,000 spectators. Nasser al khalifis departure from Paris Saint-Germain marks the end of a period of transformation and development for the club under his leadership. During his tenure as president, PSG experienced significant success domestically, winning numerous titles in League One and the French Cup, as well as achieving advanced positions in the UEFA Champions League. The period also saw significant reinforcements in the squad and important signings of global stars like Neymar and Kylian Mbappe, which contributed to elevating the team's level and making it a prominent force in European football. However, despite these successes on the domestic front, the failure to achieve the desired success in the UEFA Champions League, along with some criticisms regarding the club's management and sporting direction, may lead to a different evaluation of Nasser al khalifis legacy at Paris Saint-Germain by some fans and analysts.